Hi, I'm Joel, YouTube's 3D printing nerd, here with Matter Hackers to get you started in 3D printing. In this video, I'm going to talk about the very first layer of plastic you lay down onto your print bed and why it's important. The first layer of your 3D print is very important because it's the bedrock on which all other things are built. If you don't have a good foundation, your house will fall down. If the plastic is squished down too much or the nozzle's too close to the bed, you can get skips or blobs or no line at all. In fact, you could damage your print bed at that point. If the nozzle's too far away from the print bed, it's just going to extrude plastic into midair and you're gonna end up with a really stringy looking mess. When printing on a non-heated bed, typically you're going to use blue painter's tape over the bed. When you have a heated bed, you have a few more options. Some people use blue painter's tape on a heated bed. There's also captain tape or glass, even third party materials that you can spray on, paint on, or stick to that allow for bed adhesion. On the Jumpstart printer, it's a non-heated bed, so we will be using blue painter's tape. When printing your first layer, there are two very specific settings you wanna pay attention to in your slicing software. The first being the layer height and if the layer height is too big or too small you're either putting out too much or too little plastic and it's not going to adhere well to the print bed itself the second setting that you really need to pay attention to is the first layer speed and that's that's how fast it's able to lay down the plastic and if you go too slow your print well your print's going to take too long and you're just going to get frustrated if it's going too fast, then the plastic coming out of the nozzle may not have time to stick to the bed and you'll just end up with a mess and no one wants that. And that leads me to saying, pay attention to your bed level, level your bed and make sure that you have good space between your nozzle and your print bed. And that can be done using the Matter Control Software's bed leveling system. Well, I hope all of those tips I shared help you out. The first layer is very important and it's what all other layers are built upon. So make sure you get that first layer right. And if you do, there's a good chance all of the rest of the layers will be right. Thanks again for watching this video. I know skills within the 3D printing world vary. And so if, I, if I've covered things you already know, I hope I refresh them in your head. And if this is all brand new to you, I really hope this helps you get successful in 3D printing. So until next time, I'll see you later.